everyone, it's MXX. Welcome back to my channel. So, if you saw in last week's video, I unboxed this awesome ice cream truck that my husband bought me for Christmas, early Christmas present. But uh, if you want to see the actual unboxing, it's right here. So, click on that. Okay, so uh, in today's video, I'm going to transfer the ice cream truck that I unboxed uh, into a Hot Wheels car because uh, my favorite car from Hot Wheels was always the ice cream truck. And well, I've been a fan since I was like really little. So I've got these super cute little Hot Wheels cars, uh, which are really, really cute. Uh, but this one's kind of like the one, you probably really can't see it, but I'll show you up close. So this is the ice cream truck that I want to replicate from this one. It's the blue with the pink and I love the ice cream cone on it. But I also like the other ice cream truck as well because it's got that graffiti with the thing, but I'm gonna change some colors up a bit. So basically, I'm going to transform this into a Hot Wheels ice cream truck, except for super big. So, let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is remove all the accessories from the ice cream van. After I've done that, I've just drawn up a couple of sketches of the ice cream van and just mapped out how the design's going to look on the truck. For this project, I'm going to use all Posca paint pens. Now, I'm not sponsored to do this video by Posca. I just really like the paint pens and how good quality they are. But these are all the different colors that I will be using for the project. So I've got gold, an off orange, brown, black, pink, and white. So, sorry that I'm so much in the way in this shot, but um, basically I'm just going to sketch out my design on the side of the van with the white Fusca marker, just so I sort of have a rough idea. Um, everything that I'm doing to the ice cream van, I'm actually doing freehand, so I'm not tracing or have something already over it or anything like that. I'm just going for it. So... Yeah, that's what I'm going to do and I'm just going around the whole van doing my design. Now I'm going to go over everything and the colours I'm using. So I'm starting with the word ice. I'm doing this in a white because I want it like as a frozen ice feel and then the rest I'm going over in gold because I really want it to pop. I'm doing a lot of pink as well and big ice creams of course because it's an ice cream van. Once I'm happy with the way the gold looks, it's then time to go over with using a pink Posca paint pen. So I'm going to go around it and make it look like it's melting pink ice cream over the graffiti. Wow, what a great transformation. I don't want to bore you with this video, so I'm trying to make it really sweet and simple. So right now I'm just doing the ice cream on the one side and then I'm going to head to the back of the truck. Again with these transformations I feel they're getting worse. Anyway I'm just going over all the melting ice cream in a white Posca just to give it some highlights. For the back of the ice cream truck I'm doing another giant pink ice cream like the one I did on the side of the van and I'm also adding more of the melting ice cream. So that's how that turned out. The next side of the ice cream van has donuts and sprinkles. This idea came from my good friend Jen. Now comes my favourite bit out of the whole video, is to do the Hot Wheels logo on the bonnet. So I've done with the dripping effect again with all the pink and then I'm going over the word Hot Wheels in black. I really love how this looks and it definitely makes the truck look more like a Hot Wheels than anything. It's also my favourite design I've done on the truck as well. So that's how my ice cream van turned out. I'm so in love with it. I was going to put more little items in and fully set it up like with all the accessories, but it started raining so it was really difficult. But anyway, I love how it looks and I'm super happy with it. 
So I hope you guys like this video. I just want you to know also this is my last video for the year. I hope everyone has a very safe and wonderful Christmas and I look forward to seeing you guys all next year. Bye for now.